That's right. All right. Hey there, everyone. This is El Cow playing Hero Core. So yeah. So last time, uh, internally in my mind, I was like, "Well, I'm in hard mode. It's gonna be harder. So I'm probably just gonna do like a boss. Whoop, this is strictly a way to get to Tetron. Good." And you know, that's kind of what I internalized, but turns out, you know, although my time with the Hydra was a difficult one, uh, it still went pretty well, and I wanted to keep playing, so here we are. I kind of did like half of the light industry here, and uh, we're going to do the other half today, hopefully. Yeah, I kind of got bumped there. Ooh, but there's a unique thing down there, probably the local computer, if I were to guess. Look at all this dirt that was left. Alright, you dodge around, there you go. You got a triple shot, and you got a shot with a trail that also bounces. I got, got in a way that I didn't need to. Yeah, I don't think that digging at any of this dirt would reveal anything. Alright, so a whole bunch of guys live here. Pretty wild. They go through walls, which is pretty cheap, I think. They got the power of dreams. That's what I'm describing, I guess. I don't really know. Well, check it out, here is a thing. Oh, so this does not lead, in fact, to... No, yeah, but, like, this is, does not lead to, like, a thing. It's, uh, how I'm gonna access a lower world. Not a computer to be found here. Alright, well, that's fair, then. I'm gonna return there when I have to. I'm not sure how I died, honestly. Well, here I understand how I died. Alright, so Devin here, so it's just guys, nothing else going on, there's no reason to fight any of these. Uh, you know, sometimes it's fun to just fight, I feel like, but sometimes just, the rooms are just kind of too inconvenient. It's like, okay, well, I'm clearly putting myself in a danger. Yeah, I guess I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, I could probably Konami code to attack all around me, but it costs health. Uh, and I feel like, with the way I'm doing in general, I should be using my health for the purpose of health. Like, that's just what seems smart to me. Alright, so that does not rejoin with what's up there, but that is okay. We got things that implies that we're like, okay, well, here's a thing that I can access. Yeah, I don't have access to the side. I don't have access to cut anything here, but I do have access to robots bouncing around. Um, Accurate statement, probably. Yeah, see, this is a room where... Well, I don't know, like, they kind of take up a lot of space in the room. So I don't think that, like, not fighting them is viable. Alright, well, fighting needs to happen. Discipline must be conveyed. So I guess we will. There you go, not too bad. Lingering shots, stay in space. This is just the mine room. It's the room where we put all the mines in. Oh, they do a double explosion now. Well, isn't that the fanciest thing I have ever seen? It is not. But I'll say it is, because it feels good. Alright, destroy the world when you have to. And get hit in a dumb way when you don't. Alright, so how about the gun? How about I gonna get to you? Like that, probably. Uh, yeah, and you have a bounce shot. But as long as you're at the right place, you don't have to fear. Check it out, it's the squares in the field. Yeah, there was no way for me to go around that. I, I kind of made a... That will lead to the boss, so maybe I don't want to go there yet, and I want to finish over there? No, that is not where I thought my, my line would lead me. There you go. Because, yeah, here there's clearly, like, I know I can't go up, but I can go down, and I've never been there. So, let's look at the... Yeah, alright. That is why it was placed like that. Fell for it. Line and sinker. I, I don't need to fight here, so I guess I'll just run away because I'm being pursued. Illuminate! The dangerous person! This is a terrible room for fighting. Like, I'm not even gonna bother. Like, it's just no. Like, there is no fighting to be done here. And turns out, what I missed out all this time? Absolutely. Oh no, I can go up. There is not absolutely nothing. There's a very important orb to destroy. I don't know what you- Oh wow, there is a lot of shots here. Oh yeah, there's two cannons. I'm probably dead. Uh... Maybe not, but... 
Wow, I am not confident. Okay, they're not as strong as some of the- uh, Oh, really? That's how I die? Alright, let's try this again. This time I realize I know. I don't know how I let myself get in there. Yeah, see, I'm in the blind spot of this red shot. And this thing, while, well, yeah, it's throwing a thousand projectiles everywhere, it's kind of sequestered in that little hole. So most of its shot will not reach me. It's little mortar bounces, though, are, and, you know... God, really? Uh, I'm sure it didn't count. Oh, it did count! So a door won't count, but an orb will count. Alright, so ultimately that did not really help me in any way. But, uh, I'm glad it happened. It's all filled up on the map. What else can you ask for? Multiple things. Really? So yeah, this room down here, I did not survive. However, now I have significantly more health. Yeah, it's just like, no, like, I could fight that snake, but in what world is that worth it? Interesting, the boss is- okay, we're probably gonna go around and they'll go- they'll let us go through with something probably- wow, this is a tight little room! Uh, lots of things happening in terms of projectile here. Okay, I wasn't sure if I was hitting it. Turns out I was, which good for me. Man, this is hard. Like, this is tough. Here's an orb. Okay. And that will let us access the boss room. Got it. And that's good, because it'll also let me access the save, probably. Don't get killed. Try to avoid getting killed. Alright, never mind. Get killed, I guess. But yes, he'll get us here, and those barriers will be gone, and he'll be able to just go. Alright, try this again. I feel like that's what I need to be worried about. It's like, you know, like, a lot of the projectiles, they just go in lines, and I don't have any issues with those. But you have projectiles who misbehave and don't just go in lines, and I feel like those are the ones that catch me off guard. Light Industry Boss! It's a repair drone! Yeah, okay, so... I remember you. I have, okay, oh, and you... Wow! What a colorful, beautiful dance. Uh, and all your drones don't disappear, huh? Like, my... My blade isn't very good? So... I'm okay, so finally at some point, okay, and then that was me misusing my arrows to move. I mentioned that before, I'm not very good necessarily with that. How am I going to do this? So there I'm getting hit by everything, because I'm focusing entirely on trying to keep up with where the real one is, but yeah, the end result of that is I'm just dying. And I'm still not really doing any more damage, so... Yeah, I... oh boy. Oh, no, so... Uh, so using auto fire helps a lot. Alright, that just kill me. That just kill me on this point. Alright, well that was a mistake.
Okay, yeah, so apparently you're supposed to be able to mash faster than the auto-fire, but I'm honestly not really sure about that. Uh, uh, so this is just like bigger damage, like it doesn't really do anything else, it doesn't have like any special effect. Alright, that's fair. Uh, so this is done as much as I can. I think what I am going to do now, okay, see we want to go on the other side. So I think I'm going to do what I did last time. We are going to just step into this new place until until I find a new, uh, until I find a midpoint, a save area. All right, so yeah, I'm not sure what the effect of uh, Blaster 2 is. Uh, it's probably just damage, but like I'm never really sure about how much... Zone of Galdane, that is an entirely fictional name. Like, it's not a something of something that I can, like, recognize. Uh, I don't even really know what a zone is in real life. Alright, well, see, look how much I can feel the added power of my blaster. See, that's the issue, is that I, I, I don't know, man. What does it mean to have a stronger blaster? Because it sure don't feel like it. Alright, uh, uh, I'm probably just gonna die at some point here. You know what, when that happens, that happens, it's fine. Or it won't! I guess it won't happen when it happens. Uh, oh, and that's how I get to actually where I want to go. Well, like I said, like, I want to save in the area where I want to be. So let's keep going for now. We just kind of did a bit of a preview in that area. Maybe that's why enemies were so strong. Okay, okay, that makes sense now. Yeah, that's why there was, like, the, the soldiers. Oh my god. This game absolutely has, why did I do that? Has like a death spiral where you know like you get hurt and then leads you into getting hurt and then it just, it just kind of keeps aggravating itself. Because like you can't fire anymore after you get damaged, which again, gameplay wise, I understand. Uh, it makes a lot of sense. It's just, uh, I don't know man, it's rough. All right, I'm gonna keep going where I was going. That's what makes sense to me. Ignore that guy. Don't have to fight it. I think I need to also just ex you. Ooh, we might be able to fight here. I don't know if I have the DPS for it though. That's the thing. Also, yeah, you are going to be spending a lot of time in the wall. So I take that back. I don't think we can really fight here. Ah, um, I mean, maybe. Let's see. Yeah. No. See. No. Like, you're wasting all your time in the wall. Like, what do you expect out of me, man? Get out of here, stealing worm. Get out of here, longer worm. Get out of here, growing worm. All the worms of the world together at last. Alright, so this is a tiny little area that exists. You may visit it. And I don't want to. This kinda looks like a monster mouth that saves as the opening of a cave. I mean, that would maybe explain for that area, but that's not where we're going. Next time, Fresh Cave, the freshest in all of space.